पिघले नीलम सा बहता हुआ ये समा नीली नीली सी खामोशियां ना कहीं है जमी ना कहीं आसमा सरसराती हुई टहनिया पत्तियां कह रही हैं कि बस एक तुम हो यहां सिर्फ मैं हूं मेरी सांसें हैं और मेरी धड़कने ऐसी गहराइया ऐसी तन्हाइया और मैं सिर्फ मैं अपने होने पे मुझको यकीन आ गया All too often we let the fear of the unknown stop us but pushing ourselves out of our comfort zones helps us to conquer those fears and allow us to expand our minds and learn both about the new things and about ourselves and then there's the rush there is nothing quite like the thrill of a new experience and i am here to experience the inexperienced hi guys so i am on my way to badarwa badarwa is about 80 kilometers from kishtwar this distance can be roughly covered in 2 to 3 hours at a stretch but if you are coming straight from jammu it is around 200 kilometers and can take up to 6 to 7 hours at a stretch Bhadarwa is a hidden paradise and a scenic drive to this place is all you need to make your experience the most memorable one. I've got my first ride till Bhalra and from Bhalra I will have to change for Bhadarwa which is around 12 kilometers. The drive through the forested slopes takes you to a tiny town called Thatri and as you all know Jammu and Kashmir is known for its hospitality the person who gave me a ride invited me to have lunch with him and indulge in some local delicacies We are on the Bhadarwa Chamba National Highway and as you can see the drive is ultra scenic guys I can undoubtedly say this is one of India's most beautiful highways So if you are in Jammu and Kashmir you certainly cannot afford to miss this drive In a few minutes I will be arriving in Bhadarwa and I here I am staying uh, with a local family so we'll keep you posted with all the details
तो तो आना है थ्री डेज फोर डेज Hey, I have reached uh, Bhadarwa and I am uh, with a family here uh, with whom I am staying and they have got me to this place called uh, Fish Pond. So let me give you a quick tour of this place. Locals call this place a uh, Fish Pond. Otherwise, as you can read on the board, it says Gatha Lake. You need to buy a ticket to enter the park. This is the resort. You can see it is a splendid blend of natural beauty and man-made facilities. There is also a restaurant here, so if you are coming here, you can actually grab some snacks in the restaurant. I spent a peaceful evening soaking in the beauty of this place. It was night time so we headed back home. I was treated to delicious home cooked food made with love and warmth and the day had come to an end. It had been an exciting one filled with natural beauty. So I hit the bed reliving the memories of the day and in anticipation of the next day to come. Before I leave let me tell you tomorrow is going to be an exciting day because you guys are going to get blown away by the unbelievable place I have to show you in my next video so stay tuned